Pain in the low back is the most commonly reported pain in the United States, followed by knee pain, severe headaches, migraines, and neck pain. And look at the next stat. More than 33 million people abused opioids in 2007, resulting in more overdose deaths than heroin and coke combined. So Dr. Taylor mentioned a little bit about gate control mechanisms operating at the court. And, you know, it's really easy to get lost out in the weeds and talk about the neurophysiology of gate control. But uh, gate control can be simply uh, stated about like my, my video here. We've got a game of musical chairs going on. But in reality, that's all it is. Patient wakes up in the morning, they say, oh my God, my back hurts. Of course they, and they go, and they're, they got all that panic look on their face and they go, good. You're not concerned? No. Why? I said, pain in the morning doesn't excite me. Pain that gets worse during the day, I'm a little more concerned about. Wake up fine, feel worse at the end of the day, I'm more concerned at the guy than the guy that slept all night. What did he do? Well, when you're up and moving around, you're activating those fast transmitting fibers, the A betas and A deltas, and you get pain inhibition. But then you have to go to sleep. The chair's empty. Pain goes and takes a seat and causes a muscle spasm. So when I talked to my patients about it, I said, just imagine a one, a one chair game of musical chairs going on at your cord. Or imagine it like a teenager with no curfew, and mom and dad aren't home. The house is empty, we can have a party, in they go. And off it, it, that pain will ramp up, muscle spasm occurs, they get up in the morning, and they've got the stiffness. And then you adjust them, activate those, those fast transmitting mechanoreceptors, they feel better. But acute and chronic pain bear little resemblance to each other. You see, there are intrinsic pathological mechanisms present in chronic pain that may hinder the effectiveness of manipulation because the circuitry, in effect, changes in the way it functions. 